come I come three people. I don't come again to summer you another Tory on the Matadis day in history. I want shock on a small. Mm -hmm. I want shock on a small. Make you know say me. I sabi talk pigeon. I sabi talk pigeon. Eh? For those who think, ha, huh, this Lara girl, she just be speaking in you both spring, spring, spring. And they try it more small. She sabi speak small pigeon. Okay. Now today we're going to focus. I have switch again. We are focusing on. 28th of January, this day in history. And our focus is going to be first on the music star. 1985, the music star gathered to record We Are the Word. We Are the Word. Remember that song? So, 1985, this day in history, they gathered together to sing that song. Next, in 1998, Italian painter and sculptor Michelangelo. Yes, I got it. He's an iconic painter and he painted Christ and the woman of Samaria sold for $7.4 million. It's like I want to change career. Me too, I want to start painting. That's a whole lot. One painting for $7.4 million. Okay? That happened way back in history in 1998. And it was basically the painting of Christ and the woman of Samaria. I proceed. On January 28 in 2011, Egypt on this day um, shut down 88% of the internet across the country. <laughs> Somebody should not come and try that in the Nigeria of today. People are already frustrated. The only thing that keeps our body and soul together is when we come back from work, we unwind with our phones and all that. Someone will not come and shut it down. Ha! Another... <laughs> No comments. So this day in history in 2011, Egypt shut down 88% of internet across the country. Why? I'm just wondering. Anyway, this was because the government owned the main service provider, Telecom Egypt, and with the large protest at the time over the then president, Hansni Mubarak, the government decided it would be the best course of action. Hmm wickedness in low places if men we are god it's all right now today is a national day the lego lego we know lego is a slang like let's go but we're talking about the lego toy we use in creating and building things so this day in history the colorful plastic brick known as lego have entertained children around the world for nearly 70 years lego is used to make toy buildings vehicle creatures machines anything imaginable and they can be taken apart and put back together as often as you can that means endless creative play so national lego day is being done on january 28 to celebrate this incredibly inge ingenious and enriching toys now we move on global community engagement day it's been celebrated this day in history Okay, global, um, I'm sorry, Global Community Engagement Day. And the aim is to create awareness of individuals working collaboratively to address issues, ideas within the community. So we come together to address issues. So if in my community, if I'm to address any issue, is, is the road, the roads are bad. The electricity is like, we'll go and buy our own transformer. All the road, the pothole, we cement it. We do it ourselves. Okay, so this day is dedicated to such, any of such activity. We come together as one to deliberate on how to solve any problem we have in our community. Up next, Daisy National Day. Actually, that flower doesn't really look beautiful to me, but then I'm amazed that it has its own national day where it's been it's been cherished. So I read, just because daisies are common flower doesn't mean they aren't a special one. Daisies are native to Northern Europe because it can be found in North America, Australia, Africa, South America, and even Iceland and Greenland. The word daisy comes from the old English language day eyes. Or should, I, should that be dicey? For day eyes, dicey. Anyways, because its petals blows up at dawn and shorts at dusk. Okay, that is where the day, the word is being derived from. Day and I. So we have day, is it day I or dicey? We move on. Another thing we have here 
okay i'm sorry i think that's the last thing i have here for you okay so today we come to the end of the program but let me shock you once again brother shaggy voice even though i don't sound like brother shaggy so could you buy a little red sony lodge or sony a mini teeny toto or molara for those of you who think this girl should just come and speak english and spark and go now i've proven to you i can speak pigeon i can speak yoruba Mm -hmm. So see you tomorrow. Glory to you not. Still on the matter. Bye.